We met the three Taikonauts yesterday at that press conference, and today again we're seeing them right now at that send-off ceremony. These are the three Taikonauts that will be launched into China's space station this time. They're waving to the crowd. There are hundreds of people there seeing off our hero astronauts and the big board behind the astronauts showing you all the previous missions China has completed so far. 12 astronauts, 17 trips, 7 manned missions so far. And you know, last time when I covered the Shenzhou 12 mission four months ago, there were only 11 missions with 11, uh, 11 astronauts, sorry, with 6 manned mission. Yeah, it will be uh, the first flight for one of the astronauts this time. Chief Commander, we are the crew to carry out the Shenzhou 13 manned space mission. Now we are ready. Please indicate from Chinese People's Liberation Army Astronaut Corps, Taekwondo Jai Zhigang, Taekwondo Wang Yaping, Taekwondo Ye Guangfu, go. Yes, Commander. Salute. There you now have it. They got the go ahead to go for this mission. A little bit about the Taikonauts this time. You heard from Jai Zhigang, who is the commander this time. He commanded the Shenzhou 7 space mission in 2008 and was the first Chinese astronaut to conduct a spacewalk. A veteran space traveler. Absolutely. Lots of experience under his belt. Uh, the female astronaut you see is uh, Wang Yaping. She will be the, fir the first female astronaut to visit Tianhe, the orbiting core module of the space station. She's also China's second female astronaut. There you see the press corps. Hundreds of journalists are there. Also seeing them off are, you know, the ground staffs who work at the base and their family members, military personnel. They're all there. Many of them actually participated in this particular mission. And the last astronaut on the crew, Ye Guangfu, uh, he was an Air Force pilot. He was recruited as a trainee for China's Astronaut Center in 2010 and qualified to be an astronaut in 2014. Shenzhou 13 mission, this mission that we're witnessing today, will be his first space flight. So a mix of newcomer and veteran travelers, they make a great team. Absolutely. And now they are waving to the crowds, big smiles on them, looking confident. They will be hopping on that minivan, which will take them to the launch pad momentarily. Looks like they're all in good spirits tonight. And the weather looks pretty nice. I mean, the sky is quite clear. And Mr. Xu, how do you see this weather condition? Is it an ideal condition for the launch? Yes, we do see there's no uh, strong wind and also uh, uh, no rain. That means that uh, the uh, weather conditions are very good for uh, the upcoming mission. Of course, in, in three months, uh, three, uh, three hours, things could change. But uh, I, I see there's no, no problem at this moment.